So to break the ice for this video, I'm just going to use this new Almay thing because my face looks kind of tired. So anyways, hello again because I'm nervous um, about this topic. It is a topic that I've talked about many times and you hear about almost on a daily basis. So here to talk about my top surgery. I am going to get it 100%. No ifs, ands, or buts about that. We are just unsure when it's going to happen because of funds. Again, if anybody wants to donate, there will be a link down below for you to go and do that. I've been looking forward to this surgery for a really, really long time. Well, for me, it feels like a really, really long time. It's been about a year or so. And it's honestly, it's really hard that I have to stand here in this video today and I can't do, you know, this and then just, you know, not wear anything because if my nipple shows then the, the whole thing gets taken down. So it's weird because I don't, I, I you guys know that I'm non-binary. So trying to put me in that box is just very frustrating. So like when I go modeling and it's, it's all very female, 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 female because I'm not the height of a male, whatever. Um, it's just, it's just awkward and I, I don't like it. It doesn't make me feel that confident and when you're doing something you love, you should feel confident, you know. What I found out recently that singing, you have to be confident in yourself and think that you can sing in order to actually sing. So I started to believe in myself and slowly but surely my singing has gotten better. It's not the best in the world, but better than what it was for sure. Honestly, I didn't put on primer, so it might be my bad. And of course, you're supposed to put like concealer and stuff on. There are people that comment saying, oh, well, your chest is so small, you don't even need top surgery, blah, 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 blah. But in reality, they're pretty big. Oh, uh, they're pretty big to me. And they do hurt for about two weeks every month when I get my period because of the downstairs. And I don't know if any or many <laughs> of you guys know this, but I wish that or I dream or I don't know what word would be appropriate. But it would have been a lot nicer for me to be born the sex of a male because then... I would have had a penis and my chest would have been flat already and, and then I could just go around being non-binary. But since I was born in this body that has a vaheen, I kind of am under the title trans non-binary. But I just go by non-binary because we all make it way too difficult for everyone to understand. Believe me, I can barely understand it myself. So don't feel bad if you accidentally slip up. I know you're not trying to hurt me, but if you're trying to spite me in some way and calling me she or her or, you know, something as holy, I will definitely come for you. No, I wouldn't come for you, but I would just be like, well, so yeah. I brought it up to my parents and every single time I bring it up, they shut their mouths, don't say anything for a couple of seconds and then uh, continue a different conversation. So I'm pretty sure I'm not going to get any support from them, which is unfortunate because I would have really loved some support like I'm not really sure he's gonna come with me to the the hospital you know like who who's gonna bring me to my surgery and who's gonna drive me home because I can't drive after after my surgery can I I know I'll be drugged right so it's just it's just a little bit upsetting that they are not very into what I am I love who I am I love I love I love myself so much oh I put weight in my this thing, okay, I'm gonna say that this thing is, I like the color and the coverage, but the uh, applicator is really not, not my cup of tea. It's not really helping me. And I'm using my finger and pulling off more of the makeup than it's putting on half the time. I'd still recommend it. It is very expensive though. This is just from, uh, I believe this is from Shoppers or Walmart. So I met Judith the other day at one of my shoots, as you saw. She was super awesome and she was just like herself. And she brought her own nails and her own glasses and her own her own little stuff, you know, to make the shoot her. If if they agreed to it, she would be like, can I wear this? Can I wear my own thing? And it was very, you know, like, it wasn't annoying in a way of like, oh, I'm going to wear my own clothes. It was more of a, can I wear this? I brought this. It might go really well with this shoot, you know, or try it out. If you don't want to, you don't have to. It was very, very nice. It made me think that maybe I can bring my binders to my shoots, my black one and my skin color one. And, and if I'm wearing a, a shirt or something, a top that you can't see the binder, can I be like, hey, um, I don't have my top surgery yet, but I'm going to have it. And that's what it's going to look like. So could I like wear my binder underneath? So 
Um, hopefully that will work out, but I'm not too sure. We'll have to see in the future. That's why I love being here in Toronto. Everybody knows who I am and and that I'm non-binary and how I like to go by. So it's uh, very comforting here. And I'm excited to go to Japan because uh, I'm sure they're going to love this, this hair. I'm sure loving it. I love this color right now. It's kind of like a bluey, silver steel. I don't know. Pastel. But anyways, guys, that's pretty much all I think I had to say. I did mention the top surgery fund, which should be down below. If you guys could even just share it with your friends or family or on Facebook, I'm sure that would help a lot. Thank you so much for watching me put a little bit of makeup on and talk about my soon-to-be-gone chest. If anybody wants to... Like, it's not that flat guys i just don't like i wake up and i can like i can grab them and it's not it's not you know and when i lean over it's not very it's not that attractive to to me i'm gonna go to the gym more and uh work out and get sexy uh but yeah please leave a big thumbs up if you enjoyed leave some comments down below for me to read and if you haven't subscribed yet subscribe already i will see you next time bye